Hello, my name is Dylan Fallen, and I am one of the instructors of College Algebra at Dodge City Community College. I would like to take a moment to talk to you about the College Algebra course. Math 106, College Algebra is designed to serve two purposes, as a terminal course for some students, and also as a prerequisite course for other math classes. A terminal course means that the class is the end of a sequence or set, and that there will be no further courses beyond it. For many students, college algebra is a terminal course and may be the last math class those students ever take. This course is designed with those students in mind. College algebra is also a prerequisite course for other math classes, such as trigonometry, which is math 110, and elementary statistics, which is math 230. This course is designed with those students in mind as well. Any student meeting the following prerequisites may take Math 106, College Algebra. A student with an Accuplacer NG score of 263 or more. A student with an ACT Math score of 22 or more. Or a student who completed all 12 modules in College Prep Math. You might also consider taking this course as a math refresher if you place into Math 110 Trigonometry, but don't feel quite ready for it. In college algebra, a student will learn about the following topics. Functions. Graphing various types of functions. Domain and range. Finding equations given descriptions. Using graphs for analysis. Operations with functions. Inverse functions. Solving various types of equations. Solving inequalities of various types. Solving systems of equations and inequalities. And applications in modeling, otherwise known as word problems. This course is a credit-bearing and transferable course. This course satisfies the basic skills math requirement for all degrees. After passing this course with a C or better, a student can take Math 110 Trigonometry, Math 230 Elementary Statistics, or, with special permission, Math 120 Calculus 1. Before taking this course, it would be a good idea to review some topics. The following topics are not covered in College Algebra, but are necessary to succeed in the class. Factoring. Simplifying radicals, such as square root of 8, and exponents. The following topics are covered in College Algebra, but at a quick pace, so a review might be helpful. Solving various equations of one variable. Graphing linear equations. Inequalities. Quadratic equations of one variable. The following behaviors will increase the chances of your success in college algebra. Come to class every day that it is scheduled, or if it is online, engage with the course on a regular basis. Take notes and participate in class. Work on the homework frequently to practice your understanding of the material. Ask questions frequently. Either ask the teacher, another student in class, a tutor, or all of the above. Study for the exams, which means more practice but focused on the problems most likely to be on the exam. It comes down to effort and communication. Spend lots of time learning the material and practicing and let your teacher know what's going on if you are struggling for any reason. 